weatherman was full of shit. What is up everybody? Thanks for tuning in to another Moto John video today. We are back out on the Sportster and get a little look over there. We're out around Atlantic City today, outside of Philly. As always, thanks for tuning in. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, like this video, take a look back at any of our other videos. We're always traveling around, talking about motorcycles, checking out Philly. Today we're checking out Atlantic City. Make sure you check us out on Instagram too at the Moto John. So, like I said, outside Philly, took a trip through Jersey, hanging out around Atlantic City today, and it's not very nice out. Like they said, this was going to be the last nice day of or whatever of the year. I don't know what they said. The ride down here was a little chilly. They said it was gonna be like nice and sunny. There was such a heavy mist or fog in the air that it was almost like it was misting or raining most of the time. But they said it was gonna be one of the last warmer, nicer days of the year. So I'm like, all right, I gotta get out. Gotta get a little longer trip. We're gonna take a ride down to AC, check it out. It seems like it's starting to clear up now. I'm hoping it warms up a little bit as we go farther into the afternoon. I think that this is the bay side over here. Heading towards a beach town that's kind of below Atlantic City right now, Ventnor. I don't get over into Jersey a whole lot. I mean, mostly just going to the beach, like in the summertime. Asbury Park, Ventnor Beach, I've been to Avalon, Sea Isle, different places like that. AC every now and then. But mostly just in the summer. I don't really come over here for anything else. But before we get this little uh, tour of AEC going on here, you know what we gotta do first. That's right, we gotta get that coffee first. So we just stopped at that little coffee shop in Ventnor City, little town below Atlantic City, stopped there for a coffee. It's a pretty neat little place. The workers in there are pretty funny. They were cracking some jokes. Ventnor Coffee was the name of that place. I had been seeing that place every time I would come down to the beach this summer. I always go past it. I always want to stop there. So it's cool to get a little fall ride down in here to stop there. So we're coming up out of the uh, little beach town of Ventnor right now. Like I said, it's below Atlantic City, so we're heading back up north. This is Atlantic Ave. Heading up towards Atlantic City right now. Should be able to get some good shots of uh, Atlantic City as we start to approach up into the actual town. So we'll see what we get into. I'm gonna try to hit up the boardwalk, take a look at that, maybe took a look at the beach real quick. Probably stop somewhere to eat, getting a little hungry. There's also a lighthouse way up at the uh, kind of the north end of Atlantic City that I'll probably stop and check out as well. So make sure you let me know down in the comments if you've ever been through Ventnor or Atlantic City or if you got anybody out there hangs out at the Jersey Shore. I know I got some people tuning in from Jersey. Got some people turning in from New York, Philly. Probably get down this way a little bit. So let me know down there if you ever cruised up and down this area. Atlantic Ave through Atlantic City. I know a lot of people hang out up like northern Jersey, got the beach towns all the way up and down the coast. So fun fact, I didn't actually even realize this, that Monopoly is actually based off of Atlantic City. Did not realize that, just found that out. I guess probably you could tell by some of the names and the streets and all the stuff from the game is the same. Apparently. Monopoly was based off Atlantic City, so that's your little fun fact of the day. So I know Atlantic City used to be kind of like a booming place with like tourism and hospitality and resorts and all that stuff and gambling. Back many, many years ago, like the booming place, real happening, the place to be. But 
but I know lately it's got a bad rap. I mean, these like casinos, they're shutting down, opening up like every other day. They're changing names all the time. I can't even keep track of like the names of these places. It seems like they change every week. I think some of that happened when PA legalized gambling. That kind of hurt their business a little bit. People from PA didn't have a reason to come over here anymore, do all that gambling and stuff. Man, it's still really cloudy out. It started to warm up a little bit though while I was at the coffee shop, but it's still a little cloudy out. At least it's not all foggy and misty. It's practically raining like on the way down here. I thought maybe there'd be some more bikes roaming around here today. I haven't really seen a whole lot of people out. Maybe, maybe if these skies open up, clear up a little bit. All right, so we're starting to get a look at uh, some of the resorts, some of the casinos. We got the Tropicana right there. Been to several of these Tropicana, Hard Rock, Ocean Resort, used to be called Revel Casino. They're all pretty cool places inside. I mean, they got a lot of stuff going on. It's pretty fun. I just, it's just like not a lot of people hitting these places up anymore, it seems like. Man, these roads are all tore up. This is reminding me of Philly down here. Potholes, roads tore up, hitting all these bumps and stuff. Damn. Caesar's Palace, is that where the real Caesar lived? Let's see if I can find somewhere to park and get out on the boardwalk. Maybe just pull a little U-turn right here. We'll just park right here on the side of the road. Park right here and get out on the boardwalk. All right, so we just parked up the bike right here. We got the AC boardwalk right there. So we're gonna hit up the boardwalk. We got a black bike. We're gonna hit a casino. We're gonna take it all on black. Here we go, black bike. Betting it all on black. Every last dollar. Back on the bike, off the boardwalk. Got you a little look there. Hit up a casino, did a little gambling, bet it all on black, lost a bunch of money. What are you gonna do, you know? That's gambling, baby. Anyways, regardless of any of my misfortunes, hope you enjoyed that look at the water, good look at the ocean there, good look at the boardwalk. I mean, the boardwalk's pretty big, it's pretty cool. I mean, there's a lot of stuff going on. It's just your typical boardwalk, you know? You got your little restaurants, your weird little stores casinos hotels resorts all that stuff so it's not a bad little trip just to kind of get out of philly escape the city a little bit check out the beach check out the boardwalk so anyways now we're still heading north through atlantic city and we're gonna go find this lighthouse i think it's called the Ab absecon 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 i don't know does anybody out there know how to pronounce that if you do let me know i don't know how it's pronounced but anyways Absecon Lighthouse we're gonna go check out right now so I think it's all the way up on the north end of the city 
go park up next to that probably take a few pictures take a little video of that for you give you a look at that oh there we go there's this lighthouse that's pretty cool again this is up parts like the north part of Atlantic City right here take a little loop around this thing see if we get a little better view park right up on this sidewalk per usual oh yeah now we got a parking lot i get up in here all right let's take a little closer look at this thing Alright, so that was a quick little look at that lighthouse there. Kind of anticlimactic. <laughs> uh, not as interesting as I thought it would be. About as interesting as a lighthouse can be. But that was cool to see. Always cool to check out stuff I've never seen before. Another good shot of AC right there as we head out. So we're heading out of AC now. That's going to wrap up a little trip through AC. Had some coffee, stopped in the boardwalk, did some gambling, lost some money, ate a little boardwalk pizza, stopped and saw that lighthouse weather started to improve as we head out which is good like I said on the way down man that was like cloudy dark and like so misty and foggy but starting to warm up now which is good as we head back to Philly so we're gonna catch route 30 out to uh, out of town and we're gonna scoop back to Philly do a C I mean I'd recommend checking out AC if you get a chance it's not bad just to hang for a little bit a couple hours change the scenery see the ocean all right so like i said we're gonna boogie you on out of ac for the day hope you enjoyed that little cruise around atlantic city let me know down in the comments if anybody's ever been there before i know like i said i got some people tuning in around there or if you're ever planning to get to ac to check it out oh we got the borgata another casino over there Anyways, that's going to wrap it up for a trip through AC today. Thanks for tuning in. As always, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Check out some of our other videos. Make sure you check us out on Instagram at the Moto John. Always traveling around, keeping you up to date, taking, trying to take cool pictures. As always, ride safe. We'll catch you on the next one. It's the Moto John. We'll see you all on down the road. Peace.